Hello there, Nikki here, and welcome to my desktop. Today we're gonna show you how to fix uh, how to fix two important issues with Grim Dawn. Number one is the crashing issue. If you have an int a dual integrated Intel graphics card like I do system, I have two graphics cards, one inside the CPU and another in the motherboard and you're playing an, on a laptop, like I do, you're gonna be prone to crashes. In order to fix this, go wherever you have installed the game, directory, see, and create a folder called new. Inside this folder, what you do is gonna you're gonna move all the DLL files that I've shown here. Cut and paste them. Not copy them. If you do, you'll have to delete them from the original game directory. Doing so, the game will not have to search for them and find them easily. And now, the last part. Run the game from the original grimdawn.exe, not the GOG one, that one up there, not the bottom one. Yeah, but be one, doing so will mean the game will run in single player only. Remember, not the GOG one, the original one. This fix works for Grim Dawn GOG version. Steam, on the other hand, I don't know about Steam, because I myself don't like Steam too much. Because you don't get to keep your saved games. But yeah, that is the file you are aiming for. Now, the third issue, second issue we have to cover is the DirectX problem. If you're running on a laptop, DirectX 11 will lag your game. What you do is you make a shortcut of the exe on your desktop like come on do it oh yeah this is post commentary the original commentary crashed halfway see like so send to desktop create shortcut do not for for the love of God, try to modify the original EDXE file. Not that one, this one. Now, go to Properties, and inside that field called Target, add space, then backslash, and D3, D9. That way, the game will run on DirectX 3, DirectX 9, instead of 11. And, that, and doing so will not lag your game. Easy. As you can see, space, backslash, D3, D9. Click apply, then OK. I have already done so. But yeah, do not modify the original AXE. It will not let you. This fix works on the GOG version. Don't know about the Steam. See, if we enter the game, there is no lag. If we try this with out that line, the game would lag. Oh yeah, by the way, this is how I record. I record... Uh, I record in window mode with game capture on. And I do audio in post recording because the original OBS audio, if I try to record it, it will crash. As you can see... <coughs> The game runs smoothly, no lag whatsoever. Remember, space backslash D3 D9. Now, make sure to check out my Grim Dawn playlist and my King's Bounty playlist. Have fun and take care. This is Nikki signing out in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Bye bye.